Researchers in Missouri are on the front lines of finding a medication to treat coronavirus, but they need your help with that. In fact, especially they need your help if you have a computer. New this morning, 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan explains how you can be part of the solution with this. Charlie, a lot of people may be spending some time extra time on the home computer as composed to what they used to be. But if you've got a computer or a laptop at home that you're not using on a regular basis, you can help fight this virus. You really can. You just have to download the program and get to work. And even if you were using your computer, this program can still run in the background. It may just slow you down a little bit. Let's explain it all. Think about uh, finding a cure for COVID-19 as trying to pick about one million locks. You know, it would take scientists, one scientist, years and years and years to pick one lock. But the guys at Wash U in St. Louis have figured out a way to get multiple people to help so that they can crack the code on the coronavirus a lot sooner. I want to kind of get into the details of how, the, how all this works. It sounds kind of high tech, but it's not so uh, you know, elaborate. You just download this program from the university's website and then let it go to work on your computer. Now here's the biology class aspect of it. The program runs simulations of how the proteins that make up coronavirus act. And then it looks for the specific time when to attack that protein with a medication. And if the simulation works, well then they may have found a medication that could treat COVID-19 in humans. Now the, what you're seeing on your screen is what it looks like if you download this program and let it go on your computer. We asked researchers what they plan to do with all the information they get from the people who sign up their computers. And we're planning to put the data out there for other scientists to look at because, you know, given the time sensitive nature of this, it'd be, it'd be great if someone else bought something that we didn't and you know, together we can make some progress. And they do want to stress the importance of cybersecurity and privacy. They say you really control when this program is running on your computer. You have to give it permission. And they say it cannot access any files on your computers. Researchers have had success using this system with uh, finding a treatment for Ebola. And they say within the last month, they've had hundreds of thousands of people sign up to do this at their own home, which is awesome. We actually heard from it from our meteorologist, Gerard Jabaley, who signed up and gave us the tip here. I have information on my Facebook page on how you can sign up. I'm reporting live in Raytown, Charlie Keegan, 41 Action News Today.